been awesome to get back out here on the court with uh, all of the ladies and the coaches and uh, just to feel the energy in the room, uh, playing with some of the best players in the world. So the competitiveness is fun, uh, just learning, growing, trying to remember uh, what it feels like to, to be together again has been uh, really neat and, and watching some of the younger players come in and uh, play really well and, and also learn at the same time. One of the things I love about USC basketball is the competitiveness. It's, it brings out the best uh, in all of us just because we're all so competitive. I've been super fortunate in my professional career to, to come into each new season, whether that's with, with the Lynx in the WNBA or with USA Basketball, to where I've been able to watch uh, other older leaders and while I've learned and, and, and mastered and sharpened my leadership skills and my playing skills at the same time. So in 2012, I was the youngest player on the team. Uh, in 2010, I was the youngest player on the team. And uh, you know, this time now, uh, I'm kind of in the middle. I still have older players to watch and learn from and laugh with and compete with, but also I'm able to help and reach out a little bit to some of the younger players while at the same time using them as motivation to keep my game going sharp because they're ex extremely talented and are, are going to be so great. So it's, it's a fun, um, fun time for me, uh, and I'm enjoying just trying to soak up this experience where I'm, I'm uh, kind of in the middle. I'm extremely fortunate to have uh, the last, what, goodness, almost eight years of my life um, being coached by one of the best coaches in the world. You know, Coach Oriyama is a master. He's so committed. He's so passionate. He's so smart um, and is a competitor. And I love being around uh, someone who cares so much about his players, about the game, and playing the game the right way. Um, so I've just really soaked up every minute I can get with him, whether that was as his player in college or now my second time around uh, with USA Basketball, and then as well as having my WNBA coach Cheryl Reeve as an assistant. So I've just been spoiled to have uh, awesome coaches be with me. You know, representing our country is such a, um, it's a big deal that I think sometimes it can almost be taken for granted because we've been doing it for so long and we've been doing it well for so long that it, it may appear that it's easy, but it's really not because the smallest thing you do can have a big impact on someone. You never know what, what eyeballs are on you um, and also the legacy that you're leaving for the younger players when you're gone. Um, I, I always think the best tell of what kind of leader you are is when you're gone, the people that you were leading, what kind of leaders are they? And so I want to make sure that, that I can be a good example for the ones that I'm directly around.